And you'll have a whole lot more out of that 100,000 if you put Caitlin up there because they'll be there to watch her. They watch her play basketball, not y'all. And y'all can't accept that, that y'all product was sh That's all this is. You couldn't accept the fact that it was sh and that Caitlin brought more viewers and she brought more people spending money. You can't accept that. You're bitter and you're petty. And that's what's going to have people not want to continue to watch your damn league. Sports entertainment people were not entertained by your sport. <laughs>
She ain't acclimated with her team yet. They don't know each other. She just getting out there. Y'all still see she was still producing some of the same numbers, right? As she did on the back end at the Olympics. But her, her and her, te her team wasn't gelling. They knew that. This was just exposure for the WNBA, not for Caitlyn. This was exposure for the WNBA because they knew everybody was going to be watching. 17,000 people in the building, 20,000 people in the building. They know everybody's coming there to watch, but they were there to watch Caitlyn. And when they came over there and they see how ignorant that they act over there in the WNBA, it's like, what in the hell is this shit? And y'all had the opportunity to clean it up. You're still trying to call these Caitlyn Clark fans racist and shit like that, right? You actually should be listening to them and they advice about how y'all should clean this damn league up so more people can watch. Because people are coming. More athletes are going to start coming into the WNBA, guys. Trust and believe because these young women are going to be playing basketball because of their parents, because of their fathers now who are going to be in their lives. They're going to be, you're going to be seeing a lot more girls playing basketball. But if it's me, I don't want my damn girl playing basketball because going to that is where she got to go. That's the top. The WNBA is the top. The hell no. Not my little girl. Well, I know you can do way better than that in life. You can make more than that in life. And at the end of the day, guys, I don't care what you say. It is a business and it's about money. And the WNBA is showing you right now that it ain't about money to them. It's not about money. It, it can't be. Because if it was about money, you guys would have went like, hey, we need Caitlin Clark to succeed right now so we can continue to keep getting people to watch this shit. We need her to still be playing. We need her to be in the Olympics. We don't need her out in the first round. She's out in the first round? You guys really played yourselves. The WNBA, y'all already played y'all self. Do, do you think that the NFL is going to not show a game with Patrick Mahomes in it, the Chiefs, if they can continue to keep showing Taylor Swift? I don't give a dang how many people out there don't like Taylor Swift. I don't care how many don't like her. It's way more that do like her and like the NFL. And guess what? We're combining them to watch this sport now. Not only are they going to watch because Kaylin, because uh, uh, Taylor Swift was there, but they're going to watch that shit now because, oh, shit, the NFL is good again. They bringing back the old viewers and they bringing in new viewers, guys. They got the formula. The WNBA don't got the formula because they keep rocking with their feelings. They keep making every decision with their damn feelings. We don't care about Kaylin Clark being here. We don't care. We was good before she was here. We're trying to tell you that we was already better than this. We don't care about what y'all was. We care about what y'all are right now. And if y'all are acting like this right now, shit, I don't want to be a part of it no more. Do you understand, ladies? Do you understand that if you really did want to make money, if you really did want to bring more attention to your sport, this was the way to do it, and you didn't take advantage of it. So you know what that tells me? Y'all are some selfish-ass, bitter people. Selfish-ass, bitter people. To have had this person to come into your life right now, y'all petty as hell. Boy, y'all petty. How the hell did y'all mess this up? How did y'all mess this up, WNBA? You can't tell. There's no way in hell. There's no way in hell that the NFL would drop the ball with the Taylor Swift shit. I'm showing her every second, too. Because I know the little fangirls. Yay! They even got little kids watching the NFL right now. Because the little kids get to see Taylor Swift. Do you know how many of them line up to go to the concerts? All these teens? Boy, y'all is... I can't take it no more. I can't take it. Look, okay, Asia, yes, you was there. Asia, yeah, you do deserve all these shoes and shit because you were bringing attention to the sport. But Kaylin brought all the rest of it. Yes, pat yourself on the back. Yeah, this is for you. Look, that's for you, Asia. If you feel some kind of way, that's for you. I, you know what? I'll even look. i even give you a chocolate blast. I'll give you another one. Are you okay now, Asia? Can we move the hell on? And start paying more attention to what the hell we came in for because we didn't care about the shit. Look, go out there and play basketball, Asia. Maybe we want to watch it. That's it. All of y'all just go play basketball. Shut the hell up. Stop complaining. That's why we don't want to watch the shit because all y'all do is complain, 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 and bitch and complain about what y'all don't have and you had the opportunity to get it and you fumbled that shit. So it ain't about what you don't have no more. It's about what y'all want. And y'all want people to respect y'all like y'all been the hot shit and you haven't. That's what this is all about. Y'all don't recognize that y'all ain't hot shit. Y'all wasn't hot shit. You're getting better. But you wasn't what you thought you was. That's why they, we, everybody watches women's basketball. No, everybody does not. Hell no. Hell no. Out of 100,000 people, you probably got about 10 to 15. And you'll have a whole lot more out of 100,000 if you put Caitlin up there because they'll be there to watch her. They watch her play basketball, not y'all. 
And y'all can't accept that, that y'all product was shitty. That's all this is. You couldn't accept the fact that it was shitty and that Kaylin brought more viewers and she brought more people spending money. You can't accept that. You're bitter and you're petty. And that's what's going to have people not want to continue to watch your damn league. Sports entertainment people were not entertained by your sport. Look, that's my time, guys. I appreciate y'all rocking with me. Look, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. If you're a chocolate crew, hit that like button. Hit that notification bell so you know when you're watching the video live stream. It's a chocolate rant. You probably gonna get a lot of chocolate rants. I got some videos to react to. Somebody told me to go look at a Jason Whitlock video, so you'll be getting a, a reaction to this Jason Whitlock video that people have been asking me about. But until then, I appreciate y'all rocking with this one and all my other ones. Go check them out. Peace, guys.